Hey love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome and to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family. As always, thank you so much for the love and support. It is truly appreciated. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please drop a line. I would love the chance Ooh, excuse me to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me and um if you feel like the videos just give you good insight or input that you really need it uh that you can truly relate to please give a thumbs up and share it's greatly appreciated um the video i'm doing today is called twin flame 101 hey okas crack cracking codes downloading oddly times then receiving intense spiritual chills you know, um, it, it's just like, I've been saying this is, it's been going on for a while. It's like, even when I'm doing the videos, it's like, I'm getting so many downloads because all of a sudden my nose will start itching like crazy. Or it's just like my face will start itching. And you know, I'm getting the downloads and it will like, speak on this, speak on that. You know, um, take a look at this, focus on that, change your, your concept of this, you know, rewrite that, whatever. And you're getting it. And it's just like, you've been getting this probably... Uh, for the last week or so and it was just like when it was peaking right around the time the super moon was coming it's like the super moon is just not open up so many portals don't fold so many different dimensions it has you thinking different ways it has you stepping out of your comfort zone allowing yourself to try something different you're being very you know you're being very hungry to you know and in, in, indulge in, in you know digesting something that you're not used to digesting and these are the different things that are taking place into your life that is a pl uh, place and growth like you're rooting yourself you already been rooted through uh you know the times where your incubation state where you went been in dark darkness of the dirt so you've been going through those different things you know a lot of times we want to jump straight to our light because we don't you know it's too painful to get in towards that darkness it's too, too painful to know who our demons are you know what our demons are you know about ourselves but we had to be able to to understand those different things and it's just like now you're cracking codes on that for what is taking place so when you're doing that you're starting to see things you aren't able to see before because now it's just like when you're allowing yourself to just move out in faith you know you're moving out in faith and it's just like even when you have a thought all of a sudden your hairs it'll just start you know you get that little chill like oh you know even you wake up at odd times of the night and it'll it'll give you something that's like hey write this down you know or you're having these vivid dreams and it, it could be like I was saying in the video I was like I, I, I forgot what it was I was partying with Janet Jackson and I was a masseuse like I was proud about giving people avocado scrubs you know and I was just like what the heck does that got to do with anything and it's like you know it is it is you know I'm, I'm still trying to crack that one myself right there but it was just like an example but it, it was just like you know you're going through all these different things and they're leaving you like little Easter eggs well maybe I should have used a different uh allow me to retort um there was somebody I talked to last week and it, it was like there were guys like well, I was going to talk to you you know um and uh it was like um they don't watch my videos or anything but it was just like they were like something was guiding me to talk to you and i said okay and it was like i had this weird dream the other night and it was just like you know i kept on seeing these bunnies and it was like these bunnies were like different colors and stuff like that and i'm really trying to understand that and it's just like okay and you know not to get into anything further but it was just like you know not to get anything deep put it that way by saying okay the, the you know it was just like crazy where they you know kept talking to bunnies or whatever like that and I said did you ever it's like okay someone was telling me break it down because you know is the way your mind works you know you OCD ADA you know ADD and you got CT PGSD all those different things you, you know you really working with and you dyslexic at the same time and you going through spiritual awakening and going through ascension okay um and it really had me breaking things down I'm just writing it down writing it down writing it down you know, tell me other things, but that, you know, that's not important. And going through that, and I was just like, aha, had an aha moment, because you're going to have a lot of those, and it was just like, you know, they say bump everything else, you know, what they're telling you on, they're telling you to be careful of the Easter eggs, you know, think about the bunnies, the bunnies 
um, whole symbolization. Symbolization is is just like fertility, all this different stuff. But it's just like what, what, when you think about bunnies, what, what do bunnies represent? Easter, Easter eggs. You know, it's like look out for the different Easter eggs. It's just being popped up, and you know, it's not just in your your sleep state, but your awakened state too. Everything is being brought to you for you to be able to do that. That's how you're cracking codes. You know, and it comes to you when you you gotta think about it. Your vibration. It's more powerful when you're asleep. That's why they always tell you that's why demons come to you a certain amount of the time. It's like you're you're around you're peaking at a certain realm like around two thirty, three o'clock at night, wherever you're at in the world. Is it's really peaked at that time. But it'll be a lot of times too. Is no not peaking at that time, but it's like it's your weekend state at that time. That's the reason why you may have whispers in your ear or you may wake up grumpy or you could be you know, it, it can invade you in your sleep or different times you wake up at night, you know, because you're being watched around that time, you know, different things. You know, I've heard people tell me right when I wake up 2, 3 o'clock in the morning, all of a sudden I got scratches and, and, and bumps and bruises all over me. I'm like, shoot, those are them dark ones messing with you because, you know, you, you hitting on something, you know, you hitting on something that, that's really, really, you know, about to be a game changer for you. So when you do that, you start smelling different things or, you, you know, you being pulled out, you know, because I've had different situations where I've been yanked out of my bed. <laughs> you know, different times, you know, people didn't want to believe me until I had one of my, you know, my biggest doubter in the same room with me, you know. And, they were, you know, they had to step up here and start saying Hail Marys and junk like that. And I'm like, well, I try to tell you, it's like every time I'm around you, something crazy always pop off. I said, you, you like, I'm going to say that in front of somebody You're like, no, because I ain't going to admit to that mess because that mess is crazy. But, you know, every time they were around me, real crazy stuff would happen like that. But it's just like you're you're going through different things. When you allow yourself to step out on faith or God is like, okay, you've been yoked enough. Because I keep on hearing you've been yoked. You've been yoked. And um, there, you've gone through that, that situation where, you know, he's already planned your life out. You're, you're moving through his vibrations. Now it's just like, I gave you this gift. Now I'm telling you to work with it. This is something, this is your baby. You are my baby by doing this, but this is your baby. But I'm going to be working behind the scenes with you. But it's like I'm always quiet during the test because it's like right now you're seeing how things are, uh, um, you know, uh, are are going into that vibration. But this is at that time where God dog my phone going off. Um, you're going through these different things, and it's telling you, you know, hey. The, these are the different things that's unfolding for you in this way. Have faith into yourself. These are the different things that I, you know, I placed you up in, in that that storm for that. Now you're becoming your own storm. I'm trying to allow you to see the power within yourself because this is that power that you this always been there and I instilled in, this into you. But now for you to have that, you had to be able to go through these things. So you're just cracking codes. You're doing all these different things. You're understanding how things are going. You know, you weren't able to do it before, but then it's just like now you're starting to break things down into science about why things went the way they did. Be able to have your faith in yourself, be able to have faith in God, being able to understand you're, you're growing in all these different terms and being this person of yourself. And when you're doing that, um, you're placing this understanding in yourself you weren't able to do before. And for when you're doing that, you're getting all these crazy downloads. It's just like, you know, next thing you know, you start breaking out into these hives. Especially if your mind starts going, there'll be sometimes I'll break out and you know into wild hives and stuff like that and gotta take Benadryl. Or it'll be different times where I can't stop sneezing when I'm getting a lot of downloads. It's like while I'm doing my videos, all of a sudden my dad on nose just start itching like crazy. And um and these different things that's going on that is taking place into your life and it's giving you a better understanding on why things are going on or it'll be different um you know you had to be able to let go of the reins you know because a lot of times when things are going on into our lives we try to have control over everything or you know it'll be different times where you you just don't have that confidence within yourself that universe is really urging you to have and for that to happen you know this is what that super moon was preparing you for it was preparing a lot of people and these are these different things where you're being watched. You've been watched for a minute. You know, you've been monitored for a minute. There's good people that are watching you, but there's also bad people watching you. But either or, you're still being watched. But this is at that time where you're moving. 
you know, have faith in how you're moving. Have faith into yourself. And these are the things where it's, it's like when you crack in these codes, you had to be understanding of why certain things took place the way it did. You know? And just being able to, uh, you know, uh, place faith in that. You know, because there, you know, I keep on hearing faith. I keep on hearing belief, patience, um, trusting in the plan, understanding your purpose. You know, there are pain that moves purpose. You know, all these different things is allowing you to further your purpose. Everything is a part of God's plan, even the bad. You know, even to say it's like when you are that author, you you know, every day you're starting off a new page. You can make your life, you know, you can make your life magnificent or you can make it off as a hailstorm as other. It's your choice on how you want to start your day off. And just being able to say, you know, you, you know, because a lot of times I used to get so angry because it's like I ask God, hey, can I have a, 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 a I pray for a, a non-stressful day. And all of a sudden, all them days, you know, and next, you know, all hell done broke loose. And I'm like, I'm mad. It's like, why are you mad? Because I prayed to God to not have a stressful day. And it's like, that's where you messed up at. He's like, what you mean? God tell me to come to him and pray for what I want. He said, yeah, but a lot of times you ain't going to pray for what you want. You he going to give you what you want. He going to give you what you need. You know, but you had to be able to understand it. It's like you, when you pray, you didn't pray right. You had to be able to say, Pray to God. It's like whatever comes into the day, you give me the strength to be able to face whatever I'm facing. That's what you had to do. You know, you ain't praying for no. That's just like you praying for a good day. You know, you have to pray for whatever goes on today. Give me the strength to endure that. You know, and when we're, you know, when we're giving that, you know, you're in, you're. That's what you're doing, and it's just like this is how you're cracking codes because you're understanding just, just the way your movement went, where you can understand why it went wrong on those times, or even if there's times where you're trying to understand why it didn't, it, why understand why it happened, you didn't get that. You're understanding whether or not I understand or I didn't understand. It happened for a reason, and then I'm giving that that patience. For when it when it comes time for me to understand if it's needing for that to happen, it's gonna happen, and that's you cracking the code right then. There's a lot of times you're not gonna get the answers that you want why certain certain things, certain problematic situations happen. But just being able to understand it happened for a reason. God has His reason for everything for happening, and just being okay with it. And that was the code that you had to be able to crack right there. Is just by saying that you trust in God. What whatever happened, it was needing to happen in the first place. You know. Cause a lot of time he'll take he'll kill the connection before the connection kill you, <laughs> you know. And you're being able to understand that. So I hope you are able to resonate with the content of this video, y'all. Um, is uh, let me see who was I going to give a post notification shout out today? Uh, Nathan Stevens, much love to you. And Elf on her shelf, much love to you. And Naman um, has uh, I don't uh, hint. I don't even know how to pronounce your last name, so I, I apologize. I'm not even going to do that. And Lil Nar, <laughs> much, much love to you. I'm not going to butcher up your last name like that. But um, I know it's European. I know that. And it got two dots over it. That's all I know. <laughs> it was like two dots over the eye or whatever. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I would love to give you a post notification shout out. If you are new to my channel, please drop a line. I would love the chance to get to be able to know you as much as you're getting to know me. And, um... You know, I leave all my contact information in the description box below as, uh, you know, just being able to spiritual network. You know, I love being able to do that. Just be able to help you understand your purpose is helping you help me to help us to help each other. You know, being able to do that. So I love being able to be uh, like working with that. You know, um, a lot of people hit me up one on one. You need to uh, tell them DM me or email me. You know, um, and we can talk and go further from there. Or you're just trying to find your place in life and you just need that insight. I love being able to do that too. You know, I tell her, hey, just reach out to me and I'll, you know, I'll try to be able to guide you in the best direction that you need at that time. You know, and being able to go from there. You know, whatever we speak on is confidential and I help out the best way I can. If you're ever interested in podcasting, I have uh, the best app for that. You know, Anchor app is, is really, even if you're not tech savvy, it's very easy to use. And plus, I love dropping my new gems of my podcast here on my community section of my channel as well. If you love listening to podcasts, it's not the same videos, but it's under the same, you know, the same kind of content though. 
You know, I know some people they you did they do they do the platforms here where they do podcasts as well as videos and they, they you know they put it in podcast form as well as in videos, but mine is two different things. So um, you know, I share those there as well. Um, what else did I have to say? Oh yeah, if you ever feel uh, you know generous enough to drop a donation, you know, uh, Cash App is there as well. It's greatly appreciated. And um, whatever you're trying to manifest into the world, I'm sending so many different vibes. Whatever you're needing to get through it, to do it, I'm sending 20 million vibes towards your way to be able to get you through it. Stay persistent and consistent. You know, a lot of times they'll make you feel like things are not getting off the ground with you because you have to work so hard to get to it. And a lot of times you don't understand that's a blessing within you to keep thriving. It shows you how much you're passionate about different things, even when things feel like it's not going to be passionate about you. So, keep on going. Stay persistent and consistent with yourself. Uh, never sleep on yourself. Stay woke. You know, the devil sees that, that, that potential you have, that light of power that you have. So, he will try to do any and everything to make sure that you fall out, you bail out, you give up and give in. Just because he might have you do that today, just because he knows good and well, that blessing going to pop in tomorrow. So, stay persistent and consistent. Even through social distancing, make sure you give out love, light, positivity, words, by frequency. You never know those things. It really takes somebody a long way just because you did that. Just not wanting anything in return is going to take you even further. Please be safe and responsible within yourself. And much love to you. God bless. Shalom. I say. Grand Risings and wherever you're at. Much love. Peace.